morning my dear this is ruby teresa find the square of the following number 17 203 1098 square means how many times it should be multiplied two times that is you got to find out 17 square 203 square 1098 square 17 square means how many times you got to multiply two times first one usual multiplication you know isn't it so just i am teaching alternate methods usual multiplication you 17 into 17 this is 203 into 203 this is 1098 into 1098 so usual multiplication you know so you can do it 17 into 17 understand for better understanding hmm? for the late bloomers purpose just i am doing this how you can split this 10 7 ten, 10 7 ten, 10 10 sir and this is multiplication 10 10 sir 100 10 into 7 70 10 into 7 70 7 7 sir 49 just you add all these four that's all understand so 100 those are able to add it you can add and you can write uh, 140 otherwise 70 70 49 So what is the answer? Nine. Seven plus seven is fourteen. Fourteen plus four is eighteen. Remainder one. One plus one is two. So two hundred and eighty-nine. Seventeen square is what? Two hundred and eighty-nine. Understand? This is one way of doing. Otherwise, I uh, taught you another method also. Seventeen seventeen. One into one is one. Seven seven are forty-nine. Next one is what? One seven is seven. One seven is seven. So nine eight two. Understand two hundred and eighty nine. Next one is two hundred and three. Next one is what? Two hundred and three square. That is two hundred and three into two hundred and three. So same way. How you can split this for easy multiplication? Very good, Ragana. Two hundred. Three two hundred plus three, so two hundred three. This is very easy way to multiply since they have given in zero. Two two sir four. How many zeros here? Two zero here two zero. So how many zeros? Four zeros. Here two three sir six. How many zeros? Two zeros. Three two sir six. How many zeros? Two zeros. Three three sir nine. So just you add it. Understand forty thousand six hundred plus six hundred thousand two hundred. If you want to write, you write it directly. Thousand two hundred also you can six hundred plus six hundred. Otherwise you can write directly like this also. Next one is what nine. So nine zero six plus six is twelve. Remainder one one four. Just you compare with your ordinary multiplication and this method. Surely it will take less time only. You are ordinary or multiply upon that. In this method, we are going to find that. This is the time coming up. Surely it will take less time only. Otherwise, one more method also you can do. But this is easiest way. Understand? For the last children also, they should not omit the problem. Even though they don't know the multiplication in this method, while they are doing, they will find it out easily. Understand? Next one, thousand and ninety-eight. Next one is what? Thousand and ninety-eight. Thousand and ninety-eight square. So thousand and ninety-eight into thousand and ninety-eight. Before doing this, how can we split this? Thousand plus ninety-eight. Understand thousand thousand and ninety eight equal to what thousand plus ninety eight for this ninety eight I taught you the easy way ninety nine square means how much less when comparing with hundred hundred length compare करने को ये बोलो less आ रखो one understand so while you are adding one you will get hundred. Otherwise, what number should be added to get hundred? One. 
so that number should be square so one square one square is nothing but zero one next one here 99 minus 1 this is what 99 minus 1 99 minus 1 is nothing but 98 so 99 square is 9801 fraction of second you will be able to write this similarly 98 square which number should be added to get 100 2 with the 98 when you add 2 you will get 100 understand so how much less when comparing with 100 2 so 2 square 2 square is nothing but 0 4 you got to write in 2 digit form here what 98 minus 2 98 minus 2 is what 96 so 98 square is nothing but 9604 similarly 97 square how much should be added 3 so 0 9 here 97 minus 3 that is what 94 understand so like this you can write up to 91 up to 91 you can do the same method now we want this only understand here you see how we can write very good 1000 and here 98 here 1000 here 98 so here what 1 how many zeros 6 zeros 1 2 3 4 5 6 understand next one is what 98 into 1000 that means what 98 how many zeros 3 zeros here next one 1000 into 98 98 how many zeros 3 zeros 98 into 98 you know the easy way isn't it that is 2 should be added to get 100 that means what 0 4 then 98 minus 2 is 96 so just you add all these things understand so 1 3 4 5 6 98000 98000 if you want to add it also you can add it 98 plus 98 196 understand otherwise you do it like this 1 2 3 here next 98 Next one is what? 9604. So 4, 0, 6. Here, 188, 2 8s are 16. 16 plus 9 is 25. So remainder 2. 2 plus 9, 11. 11 plus 9, 20. 0. Remainder 2. So 2. Understand? So what is the answer? Twelve lakh five thousand and six hundred and four. Do you follow? So if you want to go for the ordinary multiplication, you can do it. Those who know it. If you want to choose this method, you can choose this method also. Understand? Thank you.